With over 15 years of training, I have finally, finally decided on the best training split, not only for myself, but I feel like this is best for everyone else, especially my natural lifters. Somebody's out there laughing. I know you're laughing. I'm serious. All right, so we're going to do the upper lower training split, chest day, back day, quad day. We're gonna squash that. The thing about it is, for us, we need to at least train each body part two times a week, right? So with that being said, the upper lower allows us to have our upper body day, our lower body day next. And what I'd like to do on Wednesdays is conditioning, mobility, um, cardio, focus type of day and we go back to upper, lower, and then a rest day. So, if you're interested in that, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Today is upper body day, so let's get it. I need a quick energy surge. I'm of a chocolate person, but I like my little gummy snacks. So let's think about it for a minute. Athletes have some of the best physiques in the entire world. Despite not being a bodybuilder style of working out. Now, when it comes to full muscle growth, I understand for some who want to go the bodybuilding route, I understand. But as far as recovery and being able to balance out each muscle, I felt like the lower, uh, the upper lower split has been most beneficial. These sessions can end up being a bit longer due to having to share that upper, that push-pull, um, these push-pull movements. But in reality, I've felt like it's allowed me to have enough time before the next session. My knees are shot. My knees are. All right, so here's what I like to do. Either four exercises for chest or four exercises for back. Like it could be a more chest, um, chest type of day or more back type of day. And whatever I do more sets of on that first day, I switch it on the next day. So let's say I do four, four sets, I mean four exercises for chest and I'll do three exercises for, for back, you know? And then on the next day, I'll do four exercises for back, uh, three exercises for chest, and it just kind of bounces back and forth. And uh, I'll still hit shoulders and arms as well, but the main focus, of course, are the bigger muscles. We're gonna start out with flies. We got five sets, 12 reps, and then we're gonna move on to our, our more heavier lifts. To bench pressing, creating the most artificial power, what you want to do is you, when you unrack it, right, is to pull, tightening down those lats, right? Right, right. I, so, I understand that, but it's like when you're, when, you're, when you're like that and you're already, you're still, you're still up as you're unracking. Yeah. And then you sit down. That's why I didn't understand. Oh yeah, like like when you're you're getting your my arch, hips, yeah. my hips are up. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, so when I do that, it's because I try to push my hips close to my body, okay. and if I do it without weight compressing my like my thoracic my spine down to the bench, yeah. I'll just slide. Okay. So I use the weight as a counterweight as I set my traps in, let the bar roll, and then I set my hips down. As I set them down, I'm kind of like pushing them back, creating more force up to my chest to get a better arch. In my feet. Yeah. Okay. 
All right, so we got the first exercise done. It was pretty much a, a warm up, but it's still an exercise. And flies is something that I like to do before my workouts and at the end of my workouts. Now we're going to go for the incline. Today it's going to be a, an upper chest strength focus, and then everything else will be volume. So this will be our main lift when it comes to going for strength, while everything else is going to be volume. And then the other, the next day, it'll be a, a decline to flat bench for strength and then the incline for volume. So you just like switch it off. I'm working up to our top set. Then we're gonna bring it down to work on about a set to three, four set to three for the incline. Uh, that'll probably be at like 315. So I'm at 315 now though. Uh, we'll probably go up 50 more pounds after this for my top set. And then bring it back down to 315. So in addition, for all my new subscribers and everybody, uh, or my new viewers who haven't subscribed yet, what I'm gonna do, all of this will be down in the description. I wanna give you guys a full week's worth of training. So you guys, it's pretty much a free program to follow along um, with video um, along with it. So definitely hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, work out the video in the description. And this is only day one, this is the first day. Yo, you guys will see you know, how like my week of training goes so you can do it yourself to give it a shot. So far back, I hate, I, I don't like this. So far back. Feel weird. It, feel, it feels weird unracking this, so. I like, I wanna go up, but I'm not. I'll probably just stop right here. I don't feel like asking everybody for a spot. Call me Bucky Nick is lucky that I'm innocent. Uh, if I didn't have no morals, I'd be menacing. Uh, how about a nigga rapping conscious, they be ignorant. Uh, how you find a hood, but still won't go legitimate. Uh, how you fuck a bunch of bitches, but they still respect the women. He's the rolling, it's another, he just got the win. Alright, so we're going to back down and we're training chest for four sets. We're going back for uh, three. I like to go two sets of chest and then a set of back. So I go two, one, two. And then finish off the back and the other stuff. Alright, we're gonna do pull ups. Nice and simple, five sets of ten. Whatever, I'd, I'd like to go neutral grip, but yeah, we're gonna go neutral grip for, uh, for the pull up for five sets of ten. I ain't looking at the clock, still falling like bra. Bitch, I get, bitch, I get, bitch, I yeah, get. Let me meditate, then I celebrate. Trying to get the cake, I don't take a break. Mm, yeah, bitch, wait. Grew up in the 90s, we was watching Ricky Lake. We was eating top ramen, no a TV dinner plate. Uh, made that couple dollars, so I probably get the steak. Go on out at John and Venice, I told Quinn and I be late. Ay, I'm so epidemic, I'ma cause an epidemic. Put my feet up in the building, bitch, I'm feeling like a dentist. Bitch, I get high. I ain't looking at the clock, still falling like bra. Yeah, I'm headed to the bus, then I'm ballin' like yeah. I ain't looking at the clock, still ballin' like bro. All right, so we're gonna move on to some dips. It's gonna be about a high rep, um, 12 to 15 reps for dips. Uh, I'm not doing weighted on this. I'm just focusing on control throughout the whole thing, and I weigh enough. You feel me? So, because when I use weight on this, it just like 
feel me? It just shakes too much. And sadly, we don't have the like a stable dip uh, area over here. So we're just gonna do more reps. We'll do 12 and 15. Christian's dad, that's a man over here doing 20 <laughs> I'm waiting on Christian's dad, he over here doing 20 cents. <laughs> We're gonna go for like a, one of the hammer turn machines, but we're gonna use this today. Four sets, 10 to 15 reps. Squash this, we're gonna switch because this is supposed to be a unilateral movement. So we want each arm to get their own amount of weight. But sadly, this is all connected. For some reason, I thought it was split. Song I'm listening to, bro. I've been on the funk old school jams right now. I'm listening to Boogie Oogie Oogie. You know that song? Nope. A Taste of Honey? Nope. Boogie Oogie Oogie? Nope. That's crazy. You like old school music? Um, it's like 70s. Maybe early 2000s. It's like disco. You said 1900s. You <laughs> said 1900s. I was born in the 1900s. 
now we're moving on to some shoulders. We want to go high volume. So we'll probably do uh, laterals and then rear rear delt raises, honestly, and finish it off. Because honestly, some majority of the time, um, on train arms are like a supposed to be an off day, but I'll train arms on an off day just to be doing something. And I don't really like to train arms on uh, my main day. Workout. This is only session one. The next session will be legs. You know, since it's leg day, we might throw in an additional. We might throw in an, an additional in that joint. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead and like, subscribe to the channel. Uh, definitely catch the socials, Instagram at FB Aftermath. Also, Alpha Lead. If you didn't know, I'm with Alpha Lead now. 10% off. Code Aftermath. You already know. Double A. Get them double A batteries. You feel me? Get charged up on that Alpha Lead. Everything I got on today, besides the flannel. Alpha me, so 10% off. You score aftermath. Catch you guys later.